Look What's Cooking is brought to you by the Culinary Institute of Virginia. Hi, I'm Bonnie Johnson here with Chef Patrick Kearney from the Culinary Institute of Virginia School of Culinary Arts of ECPI University. I love pretzels, homemade pretzels. What a coincidence, yeah. my favorite. Well, how do you, I mean, it kind of looks difficult, but I know it's not too difficult. It's not at all. It's just simple dough. You've got flour, salt, brown sugar, yeast, water. Okay, and the brown sugar and the yeast, you... The brown sugar and the yeast you mix together mm -hmm. with warm water. You don't want to be over 105 degrees because you'll kill the yeast. And then what's going to happen is you're going to have carbon dioxide being produced as well as the, you know, the gas. So it's going to add rise to, to your dough. Okay. Mix it all together? We mix it all together and then we make a solution of uh, baking soda and water and we dip it in there, drain it real well onto the sheet pan, sprinkle with salt into the oven 400 degrees for about 15 minutes. No. And this is what you end up with. And I mean, they're so, I mean, they're easy to roll out though. I mean, I actually made some. You sure did. You did a great job. Thank too. you. Really? It was kind of like bunny ears and then twist and then twist and then push down. But you could do twist, you could do all sorts of things with this. Yeah, you could make spirals, you could make buns, you could make pretzel logs, pretzel bites, anything. And the baking soda you said makes it. It adds to the color. You can see that these are darker than, you know, maybe the pretzels that you see in the mall. And the difference here, too, is these are a little crunchier. They're somewhere between something you would find in the mall and a street pretzel or a bag pretzel. They, okay. they have a nice crust on them, but, 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 but they're not dough. chewy. Right, but a yeah. little. little dough. And you could actually, as you said, too, you could make these sweet. You could do different things. Well, we're going to actually have all of the recipes at WTKR.com. And for more information about them, you can check out ChefVA.com. Yummy. Look what's cooking.